Welcome everybody in the fourth lesson for the French horn course for beginners. In this lesson I am going to be talking about flexibility exercises. Every concerto, solo piece or an etude has certain melodic or sometimes just random pattern and the flexibility exercises are there for you to uh, learn how to play these patterns. Most of the flexibility exercises are a variation of the notes of the triad or a specific interval. Also, the range differs. The simplest flexibility exercises are in the range of a fifth. Then you can go to the range of an octave and, for example, two octaves more. Today, I'm going to show you three very simple flexibility exercises. A very important thing is that you start to practice these in a slower tempo. And when you can do that perfectly on time, then you can speed up. There are a couple of technical challenges with flexibility. When you have to switch between notes very fast, the position of the jaw has to switch also very quickly, and so does the height of the tongue. As I have said in previous videos, on every note, there is a certain position in which the jaw has to be and you already have to start preparing the jaw on the note before. The first exercise is in the range of a fifth. A very important thing is that you should play each triad with the same finger combination. This way you have to work harder to slur to the next note. This exercise you should play only from the middle C till the F above. The second exercise is just a variation of uh, the first one. Now the range is one octave instead of a fifth. The same rules apply. Start to practice the slower, and when you can do this perfectly on time, do it faster. Another tip what I can give you is that when you go higher, make a crescendo, and when you go lower, make a diminuendo. The third exercise is a little bit more difficult. It starts from the middle C and goes down to the F sharp below. In this exercise, if you have difficulties in slurring the notes, make sure you give a little bit more air support. Thank you for watching, I hope my tips will help you and in the next lesson I am going to be talking about articulation exercises. Thank you.